Anna and I'm from Russia and I've spent all my money on Russian food and today I'm gonna show you what I have bought okay I want to start with my love this is brown bread it's called Darnitsky in Russia and I'm gonna show you it now actually that's my love I adore its crusts that's so fantastic I don't know that's so crispy it's so tasty i don't know how to explain it but i really love it i really really love it and you know with what do i eat it so i eat it with uh, sunflower oil you also can buy it in russia i don't know i think that in your country you also have it so sunflower oil and also with salt and i drink with it vegetal i don't know do you have something like that in your country or maybe it's not russian actually Oh, I have no idea, but I like it. This is something like juice with fruits and with milk. What else I have? That's called baranki. So that's actually dry bread, and this is with salt, with sugar, and so on. That's not safety actually when you are wearing braces. It looks like donut, but that's absolutely different. I'm gonna show you condensed milk. Condensed milk because that's really good with brown bread too. So maybe that's strange, but. That's condensed milk, uh, that's really really sweet one So uh, you can eat it with bread, you can eat it with uh, cakes and so on That's uh, really popular here, you can buy it everywhere And also what more we have, we also have uh, boiled condensed milk That actually has a brown color and this is white color Okay, as for not really healthy food, I'm also gonna show you mayonnaise So that's called uh, Moscow Provencal and Russians eat it a lot they eat potato with that, they eat uh, pasta with that they eat fish, chicken and everything but that's so fat so if you're having some problems with your stomach I strongly not recommend you to eat that you can eat pomeni with sour cream that's made from milk cream and sourdough i don't like it because that's sour for me but if you like kefir i don't know do you have any in your country or not well actually kefir is similar to sour cream but not so thick and now ooh, i'm gonna show you that we will start from that pin that's fish with oil. That's canned food and as for this thing, that's sprouts in oil or like small fish in oil. So that's small, that's with salt. Well, as for this thing, that's a cod liver. So I want to find the ingredients of that. That's cod liver, salt and paper. And the last one, that's stewed pork. So and as for ingredients, that's only stewed pork onion, salt, oh that's all. Russians prefer to eat stewed pork with uh, gretchka. So that's back with actually. So you can boil it or also you can have a porridge with milk. If you're a healthy man and you will come here, you can buy that one and uh, do a porridge with that. Okay, I will show you how it looks like. It looks like this one. Um, this is oatmeal, actually, I love it, that's a really good thing, that's really good for your body, that's really good for your stomach Strongly recommend you to try, if you've never tried before As for me, I adore Greek Ah, that's me too <laughs> As for me, I adore greenery, parsley and salad Parsley is considered to be like a really healthy food And this is the salad, so I think that you <laughs> know about it like When I go somewhere, I try to buy kids food Russian puree, it's called agusha I can't say that's really good uh, Because in Europe I bought another brand and it was better than this one Oh, now you're gonna be my favorite part I gonna show you some sweet things We will start from uh, cookies And uh, that's called jubilene, like anniversary Also I wanna show you chocolate That's the Babaevsky chocolate that's actually the most famous one here Chocolate that's called Russia It's a pretty cheap one because Babaevsky is not so cheap But actually that's better, that's better than this one What else? They're also the world famous factory from Soviet Union That's called Red October Thank you very much for watching that video Give a big thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel And goodbye!